Hey y'all, I'm in need of a new stroller. Constantly, every time I go to meet someone, they say it's new and lie. I'm so embarrassed, so I really am hoping someone has a new stroller or a gently used one. Yeah, they sell them new at stores, actually. Oh, I've returned, as I always do. You know, you guys know I'm always gonna be here, right? I'm always gonna be here for you, because I care about you. It's choosing beggars. I love stupid people. And by stupid people, I mean mean people that are also stupid. I ain't got a pot to piss in. Hey everyone, it's my son's 10th birthday next week and I haven't got a pot to piss in. Any donations would be greatly appreciated. P.S. He only wears Nike. No need for this. Grow the hell up. Kind of an interesting way to ask. Moving into their first place and they need silverware, pots, pans, alcohol, a laptop? But don't worry, the gaming console is simply a want. Oh my god, okay. Hey friends! So I move into my first place tomorrow morning. If you have anything you're willing to donate to me, please let me know. A list of my needs and desires. Okay, gotcha. Silverware, pots and pans, plates, cups, bowls, alcohol. All right, I, you had me up until that point. Any kind of laptop, PC, or Chromebook. Okay, fair. I mean, you gotta do work. And I guess, unfortunately, you are required to have a computer of some kind. The world does mandate that you are online, whether it's with a phone or a computer. So, okay, you can have my old Chromebook. It's only worth like 10 bucks anyway. Speaker. Bed sheets, pillowcases for a full-size bed, pillows, hangers. This is absolutely just a want, but a gaming console like a PlayStation or Xbox. Okay, gotcha. Definitely a need. Any Walmart, Publix, or Winn-Dixie grocery store gift cards so I can have some food. <clears throat> well, I mean, what, what if you just, you know, asked for some food? I mean, people would be willing to give you some of that too. But you said alcohol and speaker. <laughs> Only 25 bucks a day for 12 hour days. I am looking for someone who is willing to be a permanent babysitter. I'm willing to pay 250 bucks every two weeks. The schedule that we know of may change and some days, maybe 12 hours until school starts. I have two boys who are four and 10. Did you say $250 every two weeks? Holy sh**. 500 bucks a month, roughly speaking? Wow, 25 bucks a day for 12 hours. You are insane. You're insane. Pay me to take you to a bike rally. Be prepared to fix my broken van. Don't even think about sleeping in a hotel room. No rich people allowed. What? All right, let's see what this is. Vagabond road trip of a lifetime to Sturgis. It is Sturgis, right? Bike rally, room for seven, South Dakota. Cost will be gas plus gratuity for the driver. Well, that could be anything I want. How about $4, smart ass? Bring a tent, sleep on the ground, meals wherever we find a Walmart, Costco, or a joint that appeals. This outing is not for the faint of heart, the uninformed, the novice traveler. This road trip is for those who have researched the history of Sturgis Bike Week or talked to travelers who have attended over the last 84 years. This trip is for the adventurous, the souls who seek camaraderie under the most unknown circumstances. Jesus. Jesus, dude, what are you talking about? The soul that is unafraid of climbing aboard a 45-year-old hippie travel van and hope we get to Sturgis without mishap. Do not apply for a seat on this trip if you have a schedule to be back for or a weak kidney, a Karen attitude, a need to be pampered, an inability to help change a tire, wash the windshield, check the oil, push if we run out of gas, are required, okay? If you have the ability to pay $500 a night for a hotel room, if you could find one near Sturgis, you need not apply. This trip is for those living on the edge, just getting by. No wealthy lawyers, doctors, billionaires need apply unless you pay for all the expenses and the van before we start. Ask me silly questions and you have to pay me double the gratuity. Well, again, the gratuity is not, uh, gratuity is not required, right? I mean, you know, you did say plus gratuity for the driver. So we'll say that's required. It can be whatever number I want, dog. You didn't like specify a number. So what's double four? Oh, eight bucks. Okay, cool. You get $8 now. Not to say that I'm a rich guy or a billionaire or whatever. I'm just, come on, man. What the hell are you talking about? I, I do so want to have a van. I want to go on a road trip in a van so bad. Movies made me feel like I missed out on owning a van. The one I got for free isn't the one I wanted. I'm looking for a new born car seat for a boy. I'm due any day now. I was given one, but unfortunately it's pink. If anyone's willing to trade or maybe even donate a boy one, I will be greatly appreciated. Oh, shut up. No one, the baby's not gonna care. And look, if anybody makes the mistake of, oh, it's your daughter. No, it's my son. He just likes pink. Who cares? Who gives a shit? I'm so tired of the pink for girl, blue for boy. Oh, shut up. Send pics. 
ISO, ISA, uh, 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 whatever. Nice living room set located in 21215 and 32 inch TV. Nice to have it delivered by my birthday on Friday the 19th. Yeah, it's always nice to get something for free with free delivery. And on your birthday. <coughs> well, let's be honest, commenter. If there is one time of year that someone is going to have this happen to them, it would probably need to be on their birthday. Out of all things, it would need to be that, right? Watch my six dogs for six bucks an hour. Looking for a pet sitter to house puppy sit my six small doggies ASAP. It would be five nights a week, sometimes six, as I work overnights, and it would be either from 6 p.m. to 7.30 a.m. or 10 p.m. to 11.30 a.m. It would be in my house as my babies aren't used to being alone. I need someone trustworthy that loves puppies and someone that would take good care of my babies. They are hand-fed, two are on prescription food, and the other four are just spoiled and need to be hand-fed if you're there from 6 p.m. PM, it would be two feedings for the night, and if from 10, one feeding at night, one in the morning. I will pay decent to the right person, as they are my babies. What What do you mean by pay decent? Wait, where's the... Hold on. I was thinking about four to five hundred a week being that overnight. All they do after they is sleep until the morning. They don't really need much care at all. That's not how that works. Need to be fed once and <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Um, no. So I think four to five hundred a week would be a fair price, given that probably about seven or eight hours at least of that would be, or they would be sleeping. That's not the point. You're requiring that I be, like, in your home, right? You want me to, like, stay there while you're gone to watch the dogs? I actually have a couple of friends that do this. Um, they pet sit, they house sit for a living. Seems like a pretty decent gig. Uh, honestly, they make a lot the f more than this. Okay, why don't you, like, try two to five hundred a night, dog? I'm going to your house, and I have to- I just have to be there, okay? <laughs> Way more than what you're offering. In our village Facebook group, took a wee trip to Blank Harbor last night, and I was disappointed with the barbecue. No onions or salad for the burgers. What? For a free event that we pulled together last minute, I don't think we did too bad. Thank you to all those who came and supported us, regardless of lettuce or onions. <laughs> oh, I bet that guy feels like a right c Now, don't he? Yeah, that's right, you know what I said. You didn't hear it, but you know what I said. I legit thought this post was trolling, but she is indeed very serious. I've been married for 11 years and have never had a wedding. Our day is set for our vow renewal slash wedding on August 30th of this year. I need decorations, backdrops, tablecloths, and flowers, charger plates, centerpieces, stuff like that. So you want an entire wedding for free. Look, giant lavish weddings are expensive. Small, little, simple weddings are incredibly expensive. What? I love feathers and Paris themes, but even if it's another theme, I'll take it if the col- or if it's the colors I need. I'm reading too quick. Cake is set. Place for event is set. My dress is set. His suit is set. Food and drinks are still being worked on. And just to make this day even more special, we had broken up last year and gotten divorced, but God restored our marriage and we got remarried. So I've had two non-wedding weddings. First one was at City Hall, and the second one was at the end of church service on a Sunday. And the dress I'm wearing, I've had it for exactly 11 Okay, I don't need- I don't need the whole nine yards. Furnish our house, with delivery included, and don't forget the Frog Kids storage box? Hey all, please read, and if you have the items, comment below. If not, please scroll on. Don't need unnecessary notifications blowing up our phones. How dare I do such a thing to you? We need your help within a two-week time frame. We don't have cars that can tow, so be kind. We need the following delivered to our home, as the current one we're in is partly furnished and don't have the funds to purchase them, and when we leave here, we don't have a full house. What? Lounge suite, three-seater or more. Round dining table with four chairs. Wood only. Okay. Two bedside tables. Children's bookcase. Frog kids? What is what is a frog kid storage box? What are you talking about? Is it the kid's toy box, but it's a big old frog? Unfortunately, I can't get the items. I've post all in one day. There is no point. This might come across as rude, but a week or so ago, you posted complaining about people taking things they don't need, etc. Can you explain to me how you need bedside tables, two couches, why the dining table has to be wood, and I'm hoping the frog is an autocorrect and you're not actually being that specific about a storage box? From my experience, people in genuine and need are usually grateful for anything that can be offered regardless of material or style. Well, he's a beggar, and he be choosing our local area Facebook group. All right, if anyone wants to give away a guitar for my daughter as she has joined guitar classes, 
who is teaching her a very, for a very nominal rate, which goes to the charity, what? Require any of the following for age 10 years. Juarez, which is 34 to 36 inch. Another one is Hoffner. Th what? what? Uh, need guitar bag and P P plectrum? I'm sorry. I, I played guitar for a very short period of time and never got really super too into it. What the fuck is a plectrum? <laughs> also some extra strange, which is the first, second, and third string, two of each. Okay. If only mentioned guitar is available, will do. Rest will arrange somehow. Okay. CB Influencer complains about not getting free Disney tickets. Okay. I want to take all the kids to Disney this year. Someone in my DMs say they were going to sponsor it, but I haven't heard back from them. I done told these kids about it, and now I have to deliver myself. If God's will, doors will be open for me to bless them with all the heart desires. I don't think God's going to help you get Disneyland tickets for you and your kids. Okay. Can someone point me in the right directions for discounted tickets for a group trip? Thank y'all in advance. I don't know, there are plenty of touristy websites you can go to where you can get a little bit off of Disney's face price. Because, you know, Disney probably works with them, takes a little bit off of that uh, incredibly awful price point. Send us. Give me a weekend that y'all want to go and how many people so I can pay for it. Yeah, that felt legit. You can now send messages to this person. You, <laughs> Of course they weren't going to get back to you. What are you on about? Whew. Okay. Okay, I'll set everything up. Y'all want to stay at the Disney compound? The what? The Disney compound? Is that what they call it now? How much is it? I don't know. I'm scared to look at the price. You live in Florida. Y'all get a discount anyway. We do not get a good one, though. Oh, shut up. Look, it's better than nothing, okay? Also, yeah, Disney World, not uh, Disneyland. I'm an idiot. Don't mind me. I'm not someone who's been to Disneyland literally over a hundred times. No, no, no. Not at all. iPhone 12 Pro Max only, please. Does anyone have an iPhone 12 Pro Max they're willing to give for free? Must be unlocked to any carrier. I do not have the money to get a new one. My current phone took a crap and I'm using a computer at the moment. Uh, no. Licensed individuals only, please. In search of, that's what it means, I'm stupid. Someone to help me with a haircut. I've been very sick, so I can't afford one and my hair is getting out of control. I just need a fade and about an inch taken off the top. Licensed individuals only, please. What? Li Do you need a license to, to cut hair? I didn't know, is that a requirement? Anyone able to shout me some maccas for breakfast? Please, I have 2% slept rough slash didn't sleep last night going into housing today. Why does that mean that you have 2%? You mean like, wh what are you talking about? What does that mean? Why does it matter? Can't make this shit up. If someone's giving away these items, a free sofa with a pull-out bed, two recliner couches, two recliner couches, car phone holder, four to five of them I need, Dark out curtains, whatever that means. Dehumidifiers, cube stowage cab, ca what? Cube, do you mean like cube storage cabinets? Is that what you're trying to say? Seven to eight normal sized indoor trash bins with tops. Wow. Multi electrical outlet devices for multiple electronics, humidifiers. <laughs> Indoor air conditioners, those are dehumidifiers, easy to use alarm clocks. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know why that made me like giggle so much. I need dehumidifiers, and then I need humidifiers so that I can rehumidify the rooms that I just dehumidified. But it's true though, air conditioning is a natural dehumidification a agent? No, machine? They do that, maybe not as effectively, but they'll do it. Single mom looking to pay a nanny $1.43 an hour to watch three kids. Oh, woohoo! Yet again, I'm looking for a reliable and trustworthy babysitter for my three kiddos. The hours that I work are Wednesday through Sunday, 2 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. So, approximately needing you from 145 to 845? I can pay $10 a day. I work five days a week and get paid weekly, so I would be paying $50 a week every Friday. Please don't bother getting a hold of me unless you're serious, reliable, trustworthy, and good with kids. I cannot believe, like, I know that people out there are desperate. I totally understand. I watched my mom go through that a lot, having to figure out what to do while needing to work and needing to put food on the ice. I, I saw it. I get it. But $10 a day. Holy sh**. Do you genuinely think someone's gonna survive on that? How do you figure? Oh my god. A couple of things proceeds to list 25 items, most of which I don't think are necessary for a newborn. Hello everyone, I'm 35 weeks pregnant and I'm still needing a couple of things before our baby comes. I don't have income myself and my boyfriend is using each of his paychecks to our living arrangements and transportation. 
All right, well, here's the list. You need a breast pump with everything included, duckbill valves for the breast pump, ice packs, purse for me, backpack-like if possible. Okay, so you want a backpack or a purse? Pick one. Teething toys, med organization thing for me. Don't know what that means. Stroller organizer, breast milk storage for the fridge, breast milk cooler bag, size two and up diapers, teething gel, curtain rod for clothes, mirror, nursing bras, size medium to large, forehead thermometer, saline spray, sunscreen, portable sound machine, portable sound machine, toaster oven, ice maker, type C chargers for Android phones, kitchen ni knives, and any breastfeeding clothes for summertime. All right, part two of the beggar from next door. I need a few things for our house and was wondering if anyone was getting rid of these things. Curtains, curtain rods, games, like board games that can be used when it's too hot outside. Coloring books and colored pencils. Hair dryer, silverware, not plasticware. Shower curtain, shower curtain rings. Any help is appreciated. Have you looked in the for sale section? Yes, nothing I can afford right now. All right. I mean, <laughs> just be up front. I don't know, man. Just be up front. Sometimes it seems greedy. That stuff seemed like weirdly low level. Or not weirdly low level, but like, what's the highest profile thing we have here? The hair dryer? Or the, the, the flatware? I don't know. I need a dresser and a blender, forks, coke, etc. Drop off only. No questions, please. Can anyone help me son to get a dresser for his room? We need help with food, frozen food. I can't work. Uh, health issues. I don't drive. We just moved into our apartment. No money. I'm crying. Harbor Village text me. Drinks Coke's chip please help us drop of. Here at our apartment, blender spoons, forks, I'm crying. I don't drop of. Here at our apartment, thanks God bless you all. Please be here. What? What's up? Today, I'm so lost for words. Crying here, home, chilling with my son. I need prayers. Please, no questions. I need prayers. Crying here. I don't know how to feel. <gasps> Just praying in Jesus' name. I won't talk today. Just going to be alone with my son, Austin. Just here, not able to eat today. Just a hard time for me. I get, I give it to Jesus today, crying. Wow. This one's kind of freaking my brain out. I will be home all day today. I love you, Mom, Dad, Rennie, Angie. I'm here for my family. I love our son. I love my husband. I love you all. Just saying pray. All right. I can't keep doing that one. She's insane. Been going through a lot financially, and me friend, who is in the nursing field, only sent me 40 bucks. Let's not forget, she only have one child. I feel as though she could have gave more as a true friend, to be honest. But if it was her in my shoes, I would have did more knowing it's school time. But all loyalty is not the same. Ooh. Ooh, man. Uh, you know, I've been keeping it uh, fairly lighthearted for the most part up until this point. I, I gotta... I gotta say, man... If my friend who was not doing great ne needed a little bit of money, all right, and I gave them what I could, which 40 bucks is not an insignificant amount of money. I can tell you right now, uh, me and that friend would definitely be throwing, I'd be throwing more than hands at my friend if they decided to uh, blast me on their Facebook page because I only gave them 40 bucks, as if that is a insignificant, 40 bucks can allow you to eat. And I mean, like, truly get some groceries and sh**, all right? Not a whole lot, for sure. It's not going to carry you through months and months, but that that is a deciding amount of money right there. Like, it just, holy crap. I can't imagine the selfishness and arrogance one has to have in order to look at that and go, wow, you don't really like me, do you? Wow. Dude, I'm sorry, but if someone gave you 40 bucks when you're in need, which is probably more than what they might have been able to give because... In the nursing field? What, you think nurses are running around making 300 grand a year or some sh and she's just being stingy? Come on, dude. I want a free dog, even though I can't afford to take care of my cats. I also want all the other free things. Looking for Miracle here. Looking for a free puppy. Has to be a puppy. We have cats. Not sure of a breed. Might not matter. What? Didn't you just post an ad you had financial problems with the cats you had already? Good morning, newly acquired neighbors. As some of you now know, I recently retired. I'm taking a in a cat plus two of my own that need to be fixed. I'm looking for info on a space slash neuter program that offers a substantial discount or is free to those in need. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that is highly irresponsible. You can't just be addicted to collecting animals. That is a that's abuse with them. Okay, you can't do that. All right? Don't start stacking animals that you are required and obligated to take care of properly and well if you can't do it. Okay? It's up. I find it hard to believe that all the people I know 
uh, or out of all the people I know. Not one person has an F-250 or bigger I can borrow for eight hours to move my trailer. Nobody helps one another out anymore. What? <laughs> I can't believe with all the people that I know, none of them have this incredibly specific size truck or larger to help me do something for eight hours. Dude, that is a lot of work that goes on that truck, all right? That's, that's, hey, look, every single mile pulling a giant ass trailer, was isn't that like two miles on the engine or something like that? I do love how specific this is. Can't believe I don't, yeah, shut up. Looking to barter one pair of new Milwaukee heated gloves for use of your F-250, F-350, or 26 foot box truck for one Sunday the 23rd. Truck must have a trailer hitch ASAP. All right, I'm gonna blow this guy's mind, okay? Now, there is a company out there that does happen to rent 26-foot box trucks, okay? Unfortunately, that company is U-Haul. And also, unfortunately, that company does not take your f Milwaukee heated gloves as a form of payment, okay? Anybody have a registered vehicle just not being used, but the plate is active? I need a plate until next week. Uh, that feels super illegal. If I could get a golden retriever for free and someone pay my pet insurance for me, that'd be neat. I want a puppy so bad. You don't deserve one. <laughs> just a couple of things. Hi everyone, sorry for last minute, just looking for a couple of things to help with my daughter and granddaughter or help them with their fourth. Help them with their fourth, that's... See, my brain did that autocorrect thing again. Didn't need to do that. Uh, in search of chips, mayo, onion, briquettes, like charcoal briquettes, whatever. Paper plates, potato salad, mac salad, and fireworks. I hate asking, but she has three hamburger and nothing else. Thank you all, God bless, she's in Springfield. And fireworks. That's an interesting ask on top of all of that. I don't care what the celebration really is. <laughs> Struggling, but needs bookcases, home decor, and rugs. In search of, I start my new job on the 10th, but I'm just struggling a little now till I start work this week. Stuff to make my five-year-old son's room cool, he says. Dinosaur, cars, trucks, Minecraft, Fortnite, typical boy stuff, extra cat food and litter, big trash bags, disc soaps, cleaning stuff, laundry soap or pods and fabric softeners. No tide, please. Okay. Home decor items for my living room or bathroom, storage drawers, plastic totes, rugs, air Area carpets, any size, sheets, queen, full, and twins, kitchen items, bookshelves, and storage racks, and you don't drive. What do you mean? You don't drive? Man, I hope that new job isn't a very far commute. She'll marry in an empty church. Anyway, to secure your spot in our wedding party, the following things will be required. <laughs> a promise to host a party must be couples at a venue other than someone's house. Your wedding gift must be cash or check of at least $500. You must buy me or blank, depending on which side you're on, a day of gift of at least $100. You must attend every shower or party we have and will be required to purchase a gift for each one with a value of at least $50. You will sign a contract that holds you legally responsible for meeting all of our requirements and says that if you don't, you will be legally held to be reimbursing us for the time we wasted and the stress of causing problems. There is no way in burning, boiling, lava-filled Christian hell that this is an unironic, genuine post. There is no way someone out here has the balls to say anything like this. And you know what? If this is real, you're right. They're gonna be married in an empty church in front of a trash can. No one's gonna be there, and they're probably gonna poop their pants from crying. Yeah, that's right. I said it. You're gonna poop your pants from crying, okay? Oh man, whoo, I whew, went a little crazy there. I need to go to bed.